Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, Dilly Events Worldwide, and we are on December 5th, 2021. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet, and welcome to the planetary positioning and as well the volcanic activity report for week 49. As we are seeing an active planet right now, especially when it comes to volcanoes. Looking at planetary positions right now in our solar system, we have Mars and Mercury both in view in Lasco 2 and 3. On the other side of our, the sun and as well Venus getting ready for a transit with Earth. But all of the big players in our solar system are still behind us as we are moving further away from our gas giants into the winter season. You can see there right up until the end of the month, we've got Venus coming in for a retrograde on the first week of January. And then Mercury will be coming around for retrograde as well. But looking at our solar system right now and all of its players, everybody is in one corner of the solar system, which I've been noting now for quite some time. And things are just really beginning to add up and line up around here on our planet. And I appreciate everybody joining the journey that we are going through. We've been here before. Let's have a look at volcanoes from Volcano Discovery here, reporting 50 volcanoes across the world that are active and or erupting. We're going to start out here with Popo, who has let off a lot of SO2 recently. Quite a few eruptions as well. Santiaguito, Fuego, <clears throat> Masaya Volcano, in Guatemala, moving down into South America with Nevado del Ruiz and as well Reventador, Sangay, notable here, Fernandina Volcano, the Shield Volcano showing signs of unrest off the coast of Peru. Sabincaya Volcano in Peru. Moving down into Chile. Nevados de, de Chilean. As well, Villarica Volcano. Notable here, down in the South Sandwich Islands, Mica Volcano still showing signs of unrest. Over into Africa now, where we have the Niragongo and as well, near Mirigira. Eastward with Old Doño, Alangal, Erta Ale, and then over into the Mediterranean Sea, where we have an active event going on here Stromboli, still active, volcano, volcano as well, showing dead animals were found and evacuations ordered. December 1st, so four days ago, things are really acting up at the Volcano Volcano. Carrying on here, over into South China and Indonesia, with the Karinji Volcano, Strato Volcano, Merapi, as well as Semeru, which we had that 40,000 foot eruption Yesterday, which I noted in a quick video yesterday, thoughts and prayers going out to everybody there. Another one awakening here, Ilawaryung, and as well, Luatolo. So another volcano popping off just south of Luatolo. Dakono in Indonesia, as well, Ibu. Notable here, Karangatang. 
then into the Philippines with a tall volcano and as well Pinatubo, which volcanic earthquakes, earthquakes and continuous. They are continuous at Punatubo. Moving up into Japan, Swiss and Jima, as well as Sakura Jima, Aso, and as well Era, which is for some reason not noted here with Volcano Discovery. Up into Kamchatka, where we only have two erupting right now, the Karamiski and as well Shivalich. Normally there are three or four. Lucian Islands, Semis Nepochnoi, Great Sitkin, and Pavlov. Notable in South Japan here, islands, Fukutuko. Papua New Guinea has been really active all week as well. Large earthquakes through the region. Kadavor, Manam, notable Langila. Ulawan as well, woken on December 2nd, Bagana Volcano, and yes sir, south of New Caledonia, notable there, the White Island of New Zealand, and the mighty Erubis, the only known active and erupting volcano in Antarctica. Not to forget here, the island of Hawaii with Kilauea Volcano. And as well, the island, the island of La Palma, Canary Islands with the La Palma Volcano showing here the last 24 hours for earthquakes. And they are not as widespread as they used to be. And as well, not as numerous as they used to be. So it's kind of going through a pulse right now, slowing down a, a bit, but I'm sure... It is not done. The whole Mediterranean plate into the Atlantic is very active. And as well, now into the North Pole here with Grinsvon. Last updated yesterday, minor activity and eruption warning. So another volcano has awakened on Iceland. So that is an active 50 volcanoes across the planet. We are still above average for daily active and erupting volcanoes. Just giving you a quick look here at all of the earthquakes and volcanic activity around the world. And as well, I always show the SO2 models from both Null School and Windy.com. Giving you a quick browse here of sulfuric emissions, sulfur dioxide, that is the dark red or burgundy so a lot of emissions coming out of the new madrid this week and as well alberta into saskatchewan manitoba geothermal and then look at south china southeast asia very thick particulates as per usual And as well, a very intense northern hemisphere jet stream right now is really wish-washing around this ash and volcanic cloud. But look at these regions through Manitoba or northern Ontario, Alberta, and into BC. And here is the forecasted sulfuric emissions for the next three to five days i want to thank everybody for watching please share this video with your friends and family from around the world keeping humanity aware and prepared very intense particulates moving again into the new madrid this week lots of emissions coming from popo and as well semeru and uluan And yes, sir. Thanks for watching today. This has been Mike with the Volcanic Activity Report and as well, Planetary Positioning for Week 49. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please smash that like button. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your morning due.
Bye bye now. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world. 